Oh no! Oh, first of all, you've been to the Sensa Nova monogram for the Speedo Custom Menacer Revolter. Okay, I don't really. I'm not down with that, but they took away the Christmas stuff. Come on, it's New Year's Eve. That's still Christmas time, folks. That is still Christmas time. It's still Christmas time. Dad, gum it. All right, at least I'm back in pajamas here. No, Lester. And today, it's part of. Why is there a poop emoji on the darn. There's a lot of details here. Unicorns. Something I could guess. Uh, a lot of magnets. A lot of magnets going on here. Let's see. Do we need any snacks? Don't need any snacks. This is the wrong way. Where's that ladder upstairs? Aha! Okay. Let me get my headphones on. Register as is a secure assert. Okay, we're done with the gather intel. Secondary targets, we've just got some weed, that's about it. I'm gonna solo this, so that's not really important. Infiltration points. We've got all the infiltration points marked. Eight of eight. Four of four. So there's only three more points of interest that we need to scope out and I'm not scoping them. We're just gonna we're just gonna move on to the next thing. Um wait a minute, how do I get to the prep? Planning screen Here you can see useful things you have found. Tools, equipment, vehicles, buildings and so on. But how do I get Q and E. Planning, planning, planning. The secret to successful operation. By the time we make our move, the party will be over and your DJ friends will be gone. We will need a way of approaching the island, slip in undetected, or make big entrance. The choice is yours. We will need equipment for getting into the basement and cracking the safe where the documents are kept. And of course, weapons, as plan B, or maybe plan A, up to you. Finally, the island's security relies on shipments of weapons, ammunition, body armor, air support. We interrupt this, we make our lives a little easier, and maybe a little longer, too. Hmm. Well, we want to do approach vehicles first. Oh, I already have that. Prep mandatory. Well, I already have the Kosaka, how could that be a thing? Boat Longfin is the one I'm actually concerned about. I want to buy one of those. Go to the Las Mesa Police Station. Okay, we need to get to the helicopter. I just sent Flatwig a note that says, look, I'm just doing a quick setup before I have to jump in the shower and then head to the post office. So This, uh, this video is going... To be, uh, you know, probably multiple sessions, I'm thinking. I might just do one. One big, uh... Okay. Now, I'm not going to... Okay, I can see why Mr. GTA men suggested that the Phantom Wedge would be useful for this, and I think we're going to follow that advice. 
And that was in his weekly update. You have to you have to subscribe to GTA Man, period. And just watch all his videos. Yeah, he tells you everything that's going on in GTA for the week, all the sales, all the stuff that's going on. You don't have to go to, you know, the the rock star stuff and try to read everything and hunt it up. That he gives you a complete layout of all the stuff that's going on. It's fantastic. Ruffy does the same thing, only does it with a little bit more focus on the vehicles. You get a little bit, you get some, some more advice on the non-racing stuff from the GTA men, and more advice on the racing stuff from, from Bruffy. Now those are my, those are critical paths of information. Pyro almost back active again. He, he seemed like he'd done quiet for a while, but now he's doing more reviews and stuff. Well, that's good. Professional seems to be uh, you know, diversifying a little bit, so he's still doing some GTA stuff, but he's also doing some other games, too. Should put links in the descriptions here. And Sonny Evans is just still hilarious. So there, there's there's all my, my unpaid plugs. Okay, at what point? I think we're at the point where we might want to. Let's drop this down here and call in the Phantom Wedge. I tell my wife I'm recording. Just let's, you know, but no, it's knock, knock, knock. Need this. Okay. That's fine. Let's see. You know, I think we probably were better off doing this from this menu. Vehicles. Special vehicle. Phantom Wedge. Let us get the Phantom Wedge. I bought that years ago. And so now let's see if it helps us out a bit here. Come on, pop it in. Well, there's the wedge. How far away is it? Oh, it's just up, up the street. I couldn't bring it a little bit closer. It's almost worthwhile taking the helicopter over. It's in the parking lot. Okay, well, that makes sense. La Mesa Police Station with the Phantom Wedge. Now, you guys know I don't get to drive my own Phantom Wedge very often, but I do get to drive it in missions all the time, so I'm curious if we can even get this out of here. Okay, um, hello? Alright, that was a little scrapey wavy, but probably maybe the other entrance was a little bit wider, but well we're here. Bing! Gonna get a long fin. Long fin is, per uh, of course, Bruffy 1322, by far the fastest boat in the game. So getting the uh, the discount price on that, because I do intend to get one. 700 k is a priority. I, they say you have to use it in the finale. I've heard rumors of people getting the uh, the price just from doing the prep, so which would make sense, to be perfectly honest. I'm trying to, to not invoke too much damage. I know these things all got buffed, so they don't die after no time whatsoever.
Yeah, there's regular trucks. But. Do you see it? Oh, there it is. Oh, this will be fun. Lose. Okay, getting this out with the wedge. I'm gonna definitely take some bullets here. But lose the cops. That's gonna be a thing. We're just gonna. It's not gonna be much harder than it would be, you know, pulling it with a truck, I mean, as far as getting away, but as far as being unstoppable. I want to get a good long straightaway here, so... Three star, boing! Which way we want to go? We do not want to go down to the airport. I have to think of it, where are we taking this? Okay, if we keep dodging the police... Dodging and dodging. Okay, take a left. Dodge the police. Pull it back around. You always want to have plenty of road available. Okay, there's two cars up ahead. <laughs> that's that's pretty much true you do not want to hit those guys right now you want to just get up here get turned around because the police apparently not terribly bright okay I don't have stars obviously then it's okay for me to drive this boat around Well, it definitely saved me a step having to find another truck cab, and here we go. Bing! <laughs> I'm giving people wedgies on the way back. To the docks. See, I could have tried to make my way towards the docks, but then if you, you can get kind of stuck down there pretty, pretty easily. I don't know, if I do this again... Took, missed the turn. Okay, can we go down this way? No. No, of course not. Alright, well, let's take a turn around. Actually, I'm following the uh, the path that I normally take to the docks with the uh, on the a Phantom Wedge a bunker running mission. This is what I'm used to, I guess. Oh look, there's one of the trucks you can get to use instead of the, ma the marvelous Phantom Wedge. It's the marvelous Phantom Wedge. I'm gonna have to pop off here in a little bit so that Flatwig knows I'm not on for very long here because hey, I'm not. I got some of the stuff I got, I've got real life stuff. I got people knocking on the door as it is. I mean, you know, it's that kind of. Flatwig, don't be discouraged. I'll be doing a racing video sometime in the future. That's going to come down to if there's somebody online who wants to do it with me, you know, if it's.
you know, I could see... I can see there's certain people I know I'm friends with who might want to do this. I can see Coolman wanting to do it. I can see maybe Flatwick. Oh, I'm in a different crew now because it's the 17, the 1322 closed. How's to talk to? I already sent a message to to uh, Pazisco about getting me. Uh, into uh, into base again. I'll we'll see if he can, he can hook me back up. Can't believe the No, I know. He's willing to throw money around. That's no problem. As much as I like to cruise around with this, I do have to do the time warp again. Let's bang, bang, do the time warp again. Big truck time warp. <laughs> Big truck time warp again. Heavy truck time warp again. Here we go. Nuzzle, 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 nuzzle into the trees. Yay! Didn't spell a drop. Let's see. Is he still going? No, I'm not. I'm not. Do you know what we're doing? I'm gonna leave now. I guess he even spelled the drop. Let's see. I'm kind of hung up. Let me see if we even. No, I'm not picking up the champagne. I already picked up the champagne. Yeah. Biff. Oh, did we dump it in the water? I think we might have dumped that truck in the water. Oh, and the snow is gone too. Come on, usually you turn the snow on for New Year's Eve. Now they're turning it off on New Year's None of it makes any sense. None of this makes any sense. And I'm, let's let's do the time warp again for the next the next setup. 